Hey, what's up, YouTubers, and welcome back to the Head Cheese channel. Today, I'm going to be talking about Happy Death Day to You. It's a direct sequel of Happy Death Day that came out, came out in 2017. If you'd like to read my review on Happy Death Day, I will leave a link in the description below. But before I get into it, make sure you hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. And let's get straight into it. So, Happy Death Day to You is a direct sequel. It picks up where the last one left off, like literally right where it left off. And we got all the main actors back. Uh, Jessica Roth is back. And to me, she is phenomenal in this movie. Might be better than her Happy Death Day acting. Um, so this one adds a little bit of a scientific twist to it. I know in the first movie they, they throw a lot at you. There's a little bit of comedy and horror, slasher, um, all kinds of different things that they try to incorporate into the movie. And sometimes it worked in the movie and sometimes it didn't. But to me, this movie was more complete. It, it did a better job at putting everything in order and, and making things work instead of just throwing it at you and seeing if you like it or not. Um, so, but Jessica Roth is back and, and to me, she might be an underrated scream queen. She does a phenomenal job in this movie. She is great at being funny, being sad, and just being freaking awesome when it comes to going after the killer, getting revenge and, and, and figuring out who it is. So this movie throws a different twist at you. There's a scientific twist in this one where a science project is looping time and she actually gets thrown in another dimension where her boyfriend is actually um, Danielle's boyfriend and her mom is still alive. So she struggles. Does she want to go back to her dimension or does she want to stay in this new one? And in the process, she's trying to figure out who this new killer is because it's not her roommate like it was in the first one. And so... I had no idea who the killer was in this one. I could never figure it out. In in the first one, I kind of had it figured out from the beginning, but this one, I, I couldn't figure out to the very end. And they did a phenomenal job at making sure you didn't figure it out and make sure the comedy and the sadness and, and the horror were all put together nicely. And overall, they did, they did, they did an amazing job with this movie. Um, I think it might even be better than the original and I would say you definitely need to go check it out. Make sure you watch the first one, because if you don't watch the first one, you'll probably be lost in the second one. But go watch the first one, and uh, make sure you check out this new one that's out in theaters right now. Um, but hey, I'm going to leave it at that. Uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button, hit the like, uh, thumbs up button, and uh, go like us on Facebook and Twitter. And I'll catch you all on the flip side.